Last but not the least, how do I make it responsive? Because if you check, if you make it small, this is fine, but the moment you go this way, look at this. I'm sure you don't want that, right? You would probably want the um, number of slides to reduce as we make the screen smaller. Maybe on a mobile you want a single slide and then maybe on the uh, tablet you want two slides. So depending on what you really want, you could actually control that. Okay, so let me show you the code for that. Go back to Aquila, pull request, as the carousal. Okay, and then you can actually add some more properties called responsive and then you can add breakpoints. So let me copy that and show it to you. I'll go back to our settings. I'm going to paste it here. So there you go. You can see that you can pass an array of objects inside of the responsive key and then you can set the breakpoint. So like anytime it's lower than the 768 make it two slides to show and slides to sc scroll one which means one slide should scroll at a time as you can see one slide is scrolling like but if you change it to two then both slides is are going to scroll at a time so so that will be at the time of tablet when it's less than 600 uh, pixels of screen size then we can just change it to one uh, below 480 also you can do it you change it to whatever you want. You can even remove it if you want. Uh, I'm just keeping it this way in case if you want to have uh, you know, different number of slides like 4, 3, 2, 1 and whatever. Okay, so now if you check, if you refresh and if you make the screen smaller, you can see it's gone to 2 and then if you go it's, it's to 1 and this is good. This is good. All right. So that's all sorted. I hope you did like the video. If you did, please give a thumbs up and do subscribe to my channel if you aren't already. And uh, do follow me on GitHub. My GitHub handle is Imran H. Sayyad. And uh, my GitHub handle is Imran H. Sayyad. So please do follow me on GitHub. And please give star to my repository. I like all the beautiful 118 people have. My repository name is Aquila. And do follow me on Twitter as well. My Twitter handle is QueryTech. So I'm going to see you in the next video. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.